Here we go. So I'm not going to lie, I did watch this yesterday. Okay. Um, I was meant to record a video and try and put it on YouTube and stuff like that. And then I, comp I, I just haven't had a chance. So we're going to have a quick look at it now. Um, and we're going to have a look to see what we can what we can see so let's i don't know what the volumes are going to be like so let's play i might need to play with the volumes mm. yeah it's quite loud there we go so there was the Osprey that could be seen in the, the, the um, little clips that were being sent out to all the content creators. Um, oh. Okay. So we already know there's now going to be parachutes, I guess, as there was in Battlefield 4. And it looks like there's now also going to be some kind of flying suit, which is all cool. This map looks insane. I don't know what this is, but I want one. Like, look at that. Yes. Oh, some nice tank warfare as well. Gotta love playing around in a tank. Now, this bit here, so I'm just gonna pause it there, and I'm just gonna talk about that. That, to me, makes it look like we're gonna have, it's gonna harken back to the kind of situational destruction that we had in, was it, it was a Battlefield 4? Like, you know what I mean? Um, where you could pull down like the big pill, the big pillars and stuff, and they would smash through stuff. Or you could pull down the massive skyscraper and stuff like that. I'm hoping that that's what that's kind of um, kind of like playing up to is that we're going to get more situational kind of destruction again. Um, yeah, I mean it's Battlefield 2042, so the guns aren't too advanced, but the, I mean there's a lot of a little bit of tech that we're probably going to see that's going to be like the, like that dog thing. You know what I mean? That we could, that we're going to get, which I'm really excited for. Let's go back in. Um, apparently, we're getting a gameplay trailer in like three days' time or two days' time. Three days' time. Yeah, 13th, we're getting that. I'm very excited for that as well. Oh. Yeah. Don't walk down like a little corridor like that. With someone with an LMG at the end. Yes! We're going to be stealing dog tags again. Oh! Oh! So, we already now also as well see some maybe new vehicles that we're going to get. So, we're going to get hovercrafts, which is going to be just amazingly lo lots of fun. I, I don't know what kind of craziness we're going to be able to get up to with C4 in a hovercraft. Um, and then there seemed to be like a new vehicle behind it, sort of like just a, a troop carrier, but it looked like sleek and quite quite lush. Um, so, yeah, I'm quite excited about the vehicles as well. Um, oh. Ignition. The music as well that they've decided to choose is amazing as well. Um, like, as somebody who's a massive, I mean, fan of Motley Crue, like I've been to see them live and stuff, I mean, great. Right, so helicopters, so we've now got attack choppers and then the little bird thing. Kind of way to play with a little build. Now this bit. I'll wait until the scene changes and I'm going to talk about that bit. So that bit I was a little bit disappointed at. Right? And it's because of this clip that we'll go out and watch in a second. Why I was a little bit disappointed. Because it would have... There was the opportunity there for them to have C4'd it drove it in and then blew it up, which everyone knows is a very, very iconic, you know what I mean? Um, like part of Battlefield. You know what I mean? C4 in a vehicle and then chasing someone down and blowing it up, it's just, it's just Battlefield all over. 
Um, but obviously, when I first watched it, I was like, yeah, okay, fair enough. They're not really going to play up to what players do and stuff like that. And then this clip came about. Right? So, Jets. I hope they're easier to drive. Urgh. And out he comes. Yes! Honestly, Battlefield. Now, for those who remember it, that was the scene from, was it Battlefield 3? It was a very, 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 very famous clip of somebody doing that. Right, they jumped out of the um, out of the plane. They RPG'd or was smored or whatever it was. Um, a, a plane that was chasing them. They landed. They got back in the the plane and then actually did one. Right, it was one of the most famous probably see like um, like clips of like you know, I mean gameplay or anything like that that came around. I'm sure it was Battlefield Three. I might be wrong. Um, but I'm, I know it was either Battlefield Three or Battlefield Four. But I can't remember. Um, but it was so massive, and for them to actually put that in the trailer just speaks volumes. But that's why I was a little bit disappointed when I thought back about it. Why didn't they do the C4 trick on the on the quad? Because everyone did it. You know what I mean? Everyone at one point in their game and um, history did that with the uh, with the little quad bikes. Um, but anyway, let's go back in. And that's just like a scene from every match. Now this is interesting. This bit is very, very interesting. I want this to be a vehicle. So badly, I want this to be a vehicle. They better have it in. <laughs> My mind's already coming up with scenarios of how to use this vehicle. Like, I want it. Yeah. Baby. Yes. Whoa! I'm, I'm, words cannot describe the level of just sheer joy I am watching this trailer and knowing that it's coming out later this year. You know what I mean? Um, 22nd of October, I think, is the date that they've put down for it. And I cannot wait, right? Cannot wait. Um, obviously, we've got gameplay trailer coming up in three days' time. But that big cyclone thing, right, is that going to be just an event that can happen? Is that just going to be a random a random trigger event? In random matches, you'll have weird, I don't know, like climate changes? Or is that an Easter egg that they're hearkening to on that map? I don't know. Like, I'm pretty sure if it's an Easter egg, it's going to get found by geeky pastimes within, like, a minute but you know um but no honestly like i cannot wait for this game um i still need to wait to see for the gameplay trailer but oh i'm so excited right <laughs>